So, as you may have heard, Mr. Critch came on the announcements and asked some teachers to come down and do an exercise video. So, check out the other videos on our Seville page and you, you never know, you could see me doing your daily exercises. So, uh, now I can see why you always want to drink after gym because I'm sweaty and that was hard work. So, this is where we left off. We were looking at this page, looking at the writing. And we find out that next that Jack asks if it's Greek. So let's see what they say. Remember, this is hour of the Olympics. And I gave you a little thing, chapter one, part two. And I wanted to give a shout out to my class over here. We've got some elephants hanging out. We've got Nemo. We've got a stormtrooper. We've got a, even a skunk. And they're all doing an awesome job listening. So hopefully you are too. What I've got from you. So far, you're doing an awesome job. See what they notice and wonder about this next chapter section. All right, here we go. We're jumping back in part two of chapter one. Wow, is that Greek? Asked Jack. It certainly is, said Morgan. She reached into a robe and pulled out a book. For your research, she said. Jack loved his research. Jack took the book from her and he shined her flashlight on the cover. They read the title, A Day in Ancient Greece. I wonder why they would need to be going to Greece. Now you must now, what must you always remember, Morgan asked. Our research book will guide us, said Jack. But in our darkest hour, only the lost story can save us, said Annie. Morgan nodded. And you must show your secret library cards to the wisest person you meet, she said. Don't worry, we will. Goodbye, said Annie. Jack shivered with excitement as he pointed at the book's cover. I wish we could go there, he said. And I wish we could go on lots of other missions, Annie added. The wind began to blow. The treehouse started to spin. It spun faster and faster as you know at home then everything was still absolutely still thanks so much for joining me tomorrow or next time we will be here for chapter two any girls here i wonder what that means you know that i love you you know that i care about you i'm here for you please be reading your geodes be finishing up those packets be jumping onto moby max and we have lots of fun videos on here so check them out comment below tell me what you think Tell me who you are. I love you, and I'll see you soon. Remember, get those brains working, just like Mr. Cridge is building your muscles. Your brain's a muscle. you got to build it. Make those connections. I'll see you soon. Goodbye.